Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna to show you how to crochet this pretty baby blanket pattern. This pattern is uh, so lovely because of these bubbles uh, on the front view and uh, we haven't these bubbles on the back view. You can use two colors for this pattern, one for shells and one row of color for a row of uh, bubbles. I used uh, Guxin Juliet yarn for this pattern and 3.5 millimeter hook and also we need a stitch marker to uh, mark um, some of the uh, end of rows. If you're ready, let's get started. For the beginning, I make a slip knot with first yarn and then chain a multiple of 9 plus 2. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And repeat that. And when I uh, reach the desired width, add 2 chains. I made 29 chains totally. And for the beginning, slip first chain and make a single crochet into second chain from the hook then chain one again skip next chain and make a single crochet into the next okay now chain five two three four and five and skip next four chains one two three and four and make a single crochet into next Now chain three, one, two, three, and skip next three chains. One, two, three, and make a single crochet into the next. And repeat that. Chain five, two, three, four, five. Skip next four chains. One, two, three, four, and single crochet into the next. And chain three. Skip next three chains, one, two, three, and make a single crochet into the next. One, two, three. And repeat this sequence until the end. I'm at the end, so chain five. And skip next four chains, one, two, three, four. Make a single crochet into the next. Now chain one and skip next and make a single crochet into last chain okay first row is finished for second row chain one and turn the work and make a single crochet into first stitch of previous row here then uh, I have to work into this chain 5 space. I make 11 double crochet yarn over, insert the hook into the space, yarn over, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through 2, pull through 2, and repeat that 10 more times. I have to make 11 double crochets in same space. 2, 3, 4, 5, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Okay, this is first uh, shell stitch. I have worked into first chain 5 space and now I have a chain 3 space make a single crochet into that again I have a chain 5 space make 11 double crochet into that and then make a single crochet into next chain 3 space and repeat that okay at the end after last chain 5 space uh, skip this chain uh, this single crochet and chain one and make single crochet into last single crochet here 
and row two is finished for next row row three chain four count as a treble crochet and then chain two as a chain to the space actually i make uh, six chains totally and turn the work and skip next three double crochet of first shell one two three and make a single crochet into fourth double crochet chain three and again skip next three double crochet and make a single crochet into fourth and skip last three double crochet of this shell okay i have 11 double crochet i make a single crochet into fourth chain and eighth chain of this 11 okay now uh, i'm at the end of this shell five chains and skip last three double crochet and middle single crochet and first three double crochet of next shell and make a single crochet into fourth double crochet again chain three skip next three double crochet and make a single crochet into the next and i'm at the end of this shell and repeat that i uh, have to work a single crochet into each fourth double crochet and eighth double crochet of each uh, shell stitch and uh, make five chains between each two shells okay skip last three into this shell and middle single crochet and first three into this shell and make a single crochet into the next chain three skip next three and make a single crochet into the next and at the end skip last three double crochet of last shell at the end two chains and make a treble crochet into last single crochet of previous row here skip last three double crochet and make a treble crochet into last single crochet okay yarn over pull through two pull through two but don't complete that because i have to change the yarn so grab the second yarn and pull these two loops chain one to secure that and chain one turn the work in this row i have to make bubbles so make a single crochet into first stitch of previous row then chain four one two three and four and in this row i work behind uh, the row three so fold these uh, spaces chain spaces of row three into the front and make a bubble into one two three into this middle double crochet under this chain three space of row three actually i have to make uh, a bubble into sixth um, double crochet of uh, this shell of uh, row two yarn over twice and insert the hook into six double crochet and yarn over pull up a loop pull through two and pull through two uh, don't complete that because i want to make a bubble again yarn over twice insert the hook into same stitch pull through two pull through two i have to make six incomplete treble crochet pull through two pull through two this is third treble again four five and six yarn over twice insert the hook into same stitch yarn over pull up a loop pull through two pull through two now i have um oh, two four and seven loops on the hook yarn over and pull through all of them and then push this bubble into back actually this side is front side is the right side of my work and then chain nine one two three four five six seven 
8 and 9, okay? And skip these stitches, spaces, and again make a bobble stitch into middle stitch of these uh, three stitches under this chain three space, okay? Uh, I make six incomplete treble crochet into this stitch and then uh, pull through all of them. And, <clears throat> and push the bobble into the back, again chain nine, and repeat that sequence and make a bobble stitch into uh, sixth uh, double crochet of each shell of uh, row two. And after that, uh, make nine chains and I repeat until the end. Okay, at the end, after last bobble, chain four and make a single crochet into third chain of turning chains of previous row here. This is counts as the chain to space and third chain. Make a double crochet into third chain here. And this chain four count as a treble crochet such as the beginning of this row. Okay, uh, and now I remove the hook and place the stitch marker here. I want to start uh, row five with uh, first yarn, but uh, don't turn the work in this row. I start from here again, okay? Insert the hook into first single crochet and pull through that, pull the first yarn through that and make three chains as a double crochet. Now, in this row, row five, we have to work over row three and row four. So I have a chain two space in row three and chain four space in row four. I make five double crochets into both of them, here and here, yarn over. Insert the hook into this chain two space of row three and make a double crochet in the chain four space of row four is worked into this one two three and four and five okay now Make a single crochet into next chain three space of row three here. Now make 11 double crochet into both of these chain spaces. One. I make double crochets into both of them at the same time. Both of uh, chain spaces of row three and row four has placed into the work. Okay, then make a single crochet into next chain three space of row three, and repeat that until the end. At the end, we have these two spaces. Make five double crochet into both of them. One two, three, four, and five. Okay, and make a double crochet into last single crochet of row four here. Okay. Now make one chain for next row, row six, and now I uh, can turn the work on the right side, okay? For this row, row six, make a single crochet into first double crochet of previous row, chain one, 
skip next, double crochet and make a single crochet into the next. Then chain 5 and skip last 3 double crochet on of this um, half shell actually and middle single crochet and 3 double crochet of next shell and make a single crochet into 4 double crochet of next shell such as uh, this uh, row and chain 3 skip next 3 and make a single crochet and skip last 3 double crochet of this shell again 5 chains skip middle single crochet and first 3 double crochet of next shell and make a single crochet into 4th double crochet chain 3 skip next 3 and make a single crochet into the next and repeat that until the end at the end 5 chains and skip last uh, 3 double crochet of last shell middle single crochet and first 3 double crochet of uh, last um, half uh, shell 1, 2, 3 and make a single crochet into 4th then chain 1 and make a single crochet into 3rd chain of turning chains of uh, previous row ok now row 6 is finished and now I want to repeat this row, row of bubbles uh, for next row so don't turn the work again remove the hook and remove the stitch marker from here and place this into this loop and don't turn the work and I want to start next row from here insert the hook into this loop and pull it up remove that and insert into first single crochet of previous row and grab this loop through okay and chain one and make a single crochet into same stitch and chain nine one two three four five 6, 7, 8 and 9. In this row, we have to work um, in front of previous row. So, fold these chain spaces into the back and yarn over twice and make a bubble into middle double crochet of these uh, three double crochet under this chain three space. Actually, I have to make a bubble into sixth uh, double crochet of this shell. Okay, I make a bubble stitch with uh, six incomplete treble crochets. And yarn over, pull through all loops on the hook, then push this bubble into front in this time. Then chain nine. And again make a bubble into middle stitch of these three stitches under this chain three space and fold it into back and make a bubble here at the end after last chain nine space make a single crochet into last single crochet of previous row and now I can cut the yarn Okay, and now I can turn the work to start next row. For next row, row 8, I want to work with first yarn, so remove the stitch marker and grab this loop and insert the hook into first stitch of previous row and pull through this loop chain one and make a single crochet in same stitch 
And in this row, I have to work into both of these two spaces of row 6 and row 7. I make 11 double crochet into both of them. Yarn over, insert the hook under uh, this chain space of row 6 and this chain space of row 7 is placed into the work. Okay. I make a double crochet and repeat that 10 more times. Both of the uh, chain spaces of row 6 and 7 uh, are worked into, are placed into the work. And now make a single crochet into next chain 3 space. Again, I have two chain space into row 6 and 7, make 11 double crochet into that, into both of them, and then make a single crochet into next chain 3 space of row 6 and repeat this sequence until the end. At the end, make a single crochet into last single crochet of uh, row 7. And turn the work. Uh, now, for next row, we have to repeat row 3. And uh, we have to repeat row 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. These 6 rows must be repeated several times until you reach the desired height for your work. And this is my work. And you can see that's so beautiful. Okay, I hope this video will be useful for you. If you like that, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and thumbs up. Have a nice day.